Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can connect to an IP camera or to an RTSP server in Ubuntu. So these are the three things which you need in order to connect to the RTP server or to your IP camera. So first of all you need the IP address, IP address of your camera or your RTSP server. Then you need the username and password. If you have set username and password then you will, you will require those credentials and then you also need the stream name okay usually for ip cameras the stream name by default is stream1 okay or you can also find it in your camera settings or in your rtsp server configuration all right so we need to install one software which is ffmpeg so let us install it okay so you need to open the terminal i have opened here the terminal you need to run apt update So overall we have to install one package which is ffmpeg yeah so first we need to run this command apt update and then we have to run this command ffmpeg so ffmpeg is the package name okay in my case i have already installed it so once it is installed once ffmpeg is installed in your Ubuntu machine you will get a command which is FF play okay which is FF play so we are going to use this command line utility FF play to connect to the RTP server or to our IP camera so you have to specify this command okay let me clear the screen FF play then RTSP then you need to specify your credentials if you have set up any credentials on your IP camera or on your RTP server so then you have to provide those credentials here ok so this is my username and this is my password so I am going to connect to an IP camera so these are the credentials which I have set on my IP camera and then the IP address ok so my camera IP address is this then the port number Okay, the default port number of RTSP server is 554 and then the stream name okay which in most of the cases for IP cameras it is stream 1 and in case if you are using uh, in case if you are using a RTSP server so depending on whatever stream you have set that name you have to provide here now once you hit enter it is going to take few seconds and it will connect you to the RTSP uh, server ok so we are able to see here the live stream so this is a live stream of my camera my IP camera ok now suppose if you if you have not set any credentials so in that case you can connect you can specify this command FF FF play RTSP then the IP address of the IP camera or RTSP server then the port number and the stream name ok in my case it is not going to work it says unauthorized because my camera is configured with credentials with authentication right so it says unauthorized now one more error you may get so this is suppose if you are IP camera is set up with credentials so when you will be running this command or suppose you are not aware that your IP camera is set up with credentials or your RTP server is configured with credentials so you will get this error 401 unauthorized it means that your camera or your RTP server is configured with authentication so you need to pass your you need to get your username and password and still if you are getting this error it, if you are passing username and password then in that case your password or username may not be correct okay. now one more error I am going to show you which you may get so let's say if I give here a wrong stream name okay which doesn't exist okay so yeah actually first I need to pass the credentials yeah now I am passing with my credentials a wrong stream name so it will give 404 error stream not found okay so if you will spec if you are specifying a stream name which doesn't exist 
in your camera or in your RT SP server, then you will get this 404 error. So I hope these two, I would say errors which I have explained here will help you in troubleshooting in case if you are not able to connect. All right. Thanks everyone for watching this tutorial and I'll see you in the next one.